Job well done. Members of the Coast Guard Cutter Spencer came home this morning. Now compared to some other deployments, this was pretty quick, but still very important. 10 on your sides. Maria Lena Bloris is live in our newsroom now with more on the cruise mission. Lena. Well, Stephanie, the ship spent 88 days at sea, much of that time in Africa. The Spencer also partnered with the Navy and intercepted a ship with more than $100 million worth of cocaine. A lot of hugs and kisses this morning. Our cameras were at the Coast Guard base in Portsmouth when the ship came home. Families lined the pier waiting for their loved ones to step off. Even some reunions there with their pets. While away, the crew of nearly 100 was part of a mission called Ombanga May Express. It was a maritime exercise with the Coast Guard, the Navy, and 17 West African countries. The combined forces patrolled the waters off of Africa, stopping illegal fishing, trafficking, and drug running. The Spencer also stopped a Brazilian ship carrying almost 7,000 pounds of, of cocaine worth $110 million on U.S. streets. It's a long patrol on this class of ship and especially to cross the Atlantic Ocean twice in a 90 day patrol and then operate with uh, four nations. Um, super unique experience, something we'll remember for the rest of our life and the crew absolutely crushed it. They did awesome. Gonna go home and enjoy spending time together. Uh, I made cupcakes that say, of course, we love you so much. Very sweet. The Cutter's nearly three month mission was actually extended by a couple of days. They came across a ship full of drugs on the way back to Hampton Roads. We are glad to have them back home. Live in the newsroom, I'm Maria Elena Boloris, 10 on your side.